what is Remembrance Sunday about? It's about uh, remembering people that fought in the war, um, Second World War and First World War. But what was the Second World War? What were we fighting against? We were fighting against genocide. We were fighting against massacre. We were fighting against injustice. That is really what the Palestinian cause is all about. That's what people are there for. And many people are only asking for a, a ceasefire, you know, a ceasefire. Even if you're a Zionist, even if you are um, completely pro-Israeli pro, pro and, and you fly that flag, why would you not want a ceasefire? Why would you not want to people to stop dying? The other thing is about these uh, Remembrance Sunday is it wasn't only British people that died in that war. There were Muslims that fought. There were Sikhs that fought. There were people of different nationalities that came over uh, that fought against the Germans and fought. So this isn't a, um, a uh, you know, we're white, we're British, we support Tommy Robinson. These are This is our memorial and you Muslims can go and get lost. And I'm not I'm not denying that some some of them may actually have um, relatives that that did pass away in the wars, but they seem to suddenly become moral and honourable when we talk about the war memorials. I mean, if you remember on the on the last one, um, people were caught urinating on the on the very war memorials that they were they were there to protect. You know, they all got drunk. Um, this is when I I was with Raspect in the. Trafalgar Square incident where we were surrounded by Tommy goons. Now, what what I would understand is if, for instance, the cenotaph, you wouldn't want idiots sort of messing around with it or disrespecting the two minute silence that people may hold. You'd hope that this could all, all work. But I, me personally, I don't see why Remembrance Sunday and and a and a protest for a ceasefire in Palestine can't work hand in hand. Me personally. Um, and and I, I, I hate to see it, the whole thing hijacked by by Tommy goons, you know, uh, these people that come out with their football shirt and beer bellies, you know, half drunk saying, yeah, how dare you Muslims disrespect our our history? 